Hey yo, what up? Since dragon fruit plants need to hang down to stimulate fruiting, me and my dad built this trellis. For the lumber, we used one 4x4 and two 2x4s. The 4x4 was cut into 4 feet. Since the pot's bottom circumference was 16 inches, we used the 2x4s and cut 4 8 inch blocks. We placed them exactly halfway and drilled two holes to screw in these number 10 3 inch screws. We actually had to cut them by 10 inches instead of 8, but screwing them 2 inches ahead worked out just as fine. That's the base. For the top, we used the 2x4s and cut 4 18 inch long blocks. We drill and screw the blocks together, forming a square. This square will be used to support the hanging vines. So that we can attach it, we'll need to measure and cut a centerpiece. We cut a 14.5 inch block, place it in the center, and screw it in. We finally attach it, and it's time to fill the pot. It's important I use a well draining mix. I fill it up halfway so that I can transplant this yellow golden variety. I also dig so that I can place its roots comfortably to prevent transplant shock. I hold the plant at the desired level with one hand as I fill around with the other and remove its stake to tie it around the trellis. I rooted extra cuttings to complete the other three sides. Building a potted dragon fruit trellis provides plenty of fruit for small space gardeners. Follow to see how I train it against the trellis. Grow with me.